In tonight's Eye on Earth, art inspiring action. Right now, there are new climate exhibits at the PBD Essex Museum in Salem. And as WBZ meteorologist Jacob Wyckoff shows us, dozens of artists contributed to raise awareness about the challenges ahead. Um. Nature makes me happy. Be good to Earth. Those are just a few of the words visitors to the Peabody Essex Museum's newest exhibit have shared. There you'll find yourself looking at all kinds of very unique art. Looking at climate and environment from a variety of different perspectives. Jane Winchell is the curator for the Climate Action Inspiring Change exhibit. Made up of 28 different artists, young and old, local and international. And while the mediums may be different. This was based on Hurricane Sandy. The subject is the same our changing climate. It's so important for connecting with pe people at an emotional level and helping them um, see this issue in a different way. Where statistics or reports may fail to reach someone, the museum sees this as an opportunity. There are many known solutions and and a lot of people are feeling in despair about the current situation. There's things we can do right this moment. Like to re-examine our impacts from the food pyramid. Which is the heaviest that you guys have seen? The hamburger. The hamburger? You may even recognize some of the artists, like Worcester native Jill Pelto, whom WBZ featured in its Da Vinci of Data Art story last year. I think that's a lot of the power that art has. There are a total of four climate-themed exhibitions on the museum grounds, like Down to the Bone, a glimpse at hungry polar bears, and the Blue Trees installation outside meant to spur discussion on the role trees play in our environment. Having a variety of different kinds of artwork so that not every piece of work is going to relate to everybody. Right. And, and so finding something that resonates for you as an individual is part of what I'm, my intention. In Salem, meteorologist Jacob Wyckoff, WBZ News. It is remarkable. We have so many world-class museums yep. all around us. Absolutely. I gotta say, I was a little puzzled by the paint on the bark of the tree. They say it wears off over time. They said it would wash away. All right, they're the, the experts. Oh, we